where it continues on an infrastructure package that's expected to have great benefits for rural America. $621 billion would be targeted at transportation projects that help farmers get their products to market. Things like roads and bridges, where we know a lot of our structurally deficient bridges or roads that need work are in rural communities. He says it also includes a major investment in the inland waterways system and export ports. Certainly if you're involved in agriculture, uh, getting goods to market is often a matter of the quality of our ports. Plus the plan promotes less traditional infrastructure like rural broadband and biofuels. Things like extending a blender's tax credit, looking at how biofuels could be part of the solution that perhaps for aviation, uh, making sure we're supporting R&D and, and, and a healthy mix of advanced renewables, including biofuels. And consumers gain from a strong transportation system because it keeps food prices affordable. This Heartland Consumer Report is sponsored by South Dakota Soybean Farmers and their Soybean Checkoff.